this. But you will walk out of here later with something to give to the world, to expand the experience of love in all things. Even, even the I, I was raised in Long Island, New York. My family's <laughs> my, my, my family still thinks I'm visiting. They can't believe their cars out of me. They, they, they said to me, my brother said to me, he said, don't you guys have like carts and horses and stuff still out there? You know, he, he works on Wall Street. So their mentality got easy is very great. I've got to slow it down a little bit. Uh, when I come out here, when I enter DIA now, when I, when I go back on Friday, when I enter that zone, whoop, I had to speed it up a bit. Now this is a little technique that you can do from NLP called pacing and leading. Pacing and leading. And this has to do with the energy that you're putting out or another human being is putting out. And it's subconscious. What you do is you mimic the tonality, 38% of communication, 68% body language, and the rest is just message. So you use your tonality and you use your body language to make a connection. It's all about the love. It is all about the love. The people that, that are behind you, the people that are behind me, they're, they're not behind me because they, they like my book. They're, they're behind me because they've seen me. They've connected with me. When Les Brown's been calling me a couple times every week, he'll call me up and he'll say, I write this and I'm this and I'm applying this and I'm doing this. I'm like, how's it make you feel, Les? This is healing because it's a connection. You're connecting all the time. So when a human being comes up to you, and I'm just going to put this down here for a second, and let's just say they're talking to you and they're telling you something. And let's just say they're from New York. So they're talking like this. And they got the language and they're going a little bit faster. A little bit faster than people out here. I'll tell you that much. So, so they're sitting there talking and telling you this and this is what I'm going to be doing this on Friday. So, so you get out and you're like, hey, how's it going? It's going pretty good. Hey, man. man. He teases me about the man. He's like, man, we don't say man out here in Colorado. <laughs> He's like, man. I'm like, that's nothing. You like him to say man. And then you raise your tonality. I do this because I talk to the media a lot. I've been talking to, to a bunch of the media in New York. I'm going, I'm going back there. And so they'll, they'll pick up, like, okay, what do you got? What's your patch? What do you got? This is my patch. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, what do you got? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bye. So now when I talk to someone out in California, I just slow it down a bit. Slow it down a bit when I'm out here. So be aware of your tonality next time. It's kind of a fun little practice on how to connect with human beings. And when you make a good connection, that is a very, very quick way to reduce the stress in your body. You feel good. So people say, well, what's the, what's the key to stress relief? Make good connections. First within. You got to connect within. Then you can go outside. Then you can step outside the house. But if, you're, if your outside is, is, is looking bleak, then you gotta go inside. You gotta come back home. Come back in. The heart develop first. Get out of the head, drop into the heart. And then you can go out and light up the world. And so, the person's talking with their hands folded like this, or they might every now and then just kind of run their hand through their hair or whatever it is. You just pause for a minute, you just be aware of this, and listen to what they're saying, and then just kind of mimic. You're standing like this, just kind of mimic their behavior with a little pause in between. They start speeding things up, and this is a great way to bring down anger. Because if somebody's just going off, can you believe they did that? No, I can't believe they did that. Do you ever watch Seinfeld? You gotta sit out back and forth like this? I can't believe it, I can't believe it. They're doing NLP. They don't even know it. And they're, and they're connecting. You raise your intonation, you drop your intonation. In fact, they say when, when somebody's angry, you, the, the way to, to bring some, home someone back in is you go right below the anger level. So they're screaming and yelling at the top of their lungs. You want to validate that. And they're going off on something. Well, I understand what you're saying. Let's you know, down, back down here. 
and then you can slowly bring them back down. And they don't even know what's going on. And all of a sudden, you've validated them and then led them through it. And then they feel good, and then you feel good because you made the connection.